In 2010, the UAE Deaf Association was established by its chairman, Hamad Haza al darmaki who hoped to give the deaf a voice. In the same year, Kalimati Speech and Communication Centre opened in a bid to fulfil the growing demand for speech therapy services in the country. Now that awareness is increasing amongst the public, they hope to further educate the community on the importance of learning and appreciating sign language. Khadija Sali reports. The World Health Organization puts the number of the deaf and hearing impaired at more than 5% of the global population or 360 million people. In the UAE, the number is unknown, but they exist, a thriving community of young and talented individuals. Among them is Noura, who like any girl her age is vivacious and full of ideas about the world around her. Unfortunately, there are not many who can relate to sign language in the country at present. In response, her mother Badur al-Rakbani founded Kalimati Speech and Communication Center in Dubai. We really want people to know more about sign language. We really want people to know about how to communicate with the deaf community. Uh, my daughter being deaf, she's always wanted people to come and communicate with her. But the thing is, she's always needing an interpreter or someone who knows sign language to speak her voice, to speak her ideas, to speak her language. So at this very young age, she's, she always tells me, Mama, why can't they sign to me instead of me always needing someone to, to explain. In April this year, the Hear My Voice Empowering the Deaf conference aimed to raise awareness and educate the public. At the event, His Excellency Sheikh Nahyan bin Mubarak Al Nahyan, Minister of Culture, Youth and Community Development, reiterated the importance of societal inclusion in support of the deaf and everyone with special needs. The government uh, or the leadership uh, committed to enable those with special needs to be able to lead a uh, noble life, a life of uh, a rewarding life, um, life uh, to, that be able to participate in the development of the, in their country. The UAE Deaf Association in Al Ain and Kalimati in Dubai are just some of the centers in the country that provide sign language courses. It is hoped that through all these efforts, there will be more integration, educational and vocational opportunities for the deaf. Now that the silence has been broken, there is a need to continue the conversation and learn the signs that says we are all one. Emirati Sign Language Dictionary is a project that is being actually compiled at the moment. It's sponsored by Zaid Hire Organization. I'm a member of the committee and uh, we are in the process uh, of, you know, finalizing. Maybe it's going to take a year or two, but we're very happy that we're actually documenting it for the first time. Additionally, Kalimati, in collaboration with the UAE Deaf Association and Think Up, organized a 10 day outreach program with Emirati singer Hussein Al Jasmi as their campaign ambassador to promote awareness for the deaf and the importance of sign language. We have the culture of giving back. We have the, the mentality that says uh, every person in this society has to have. Uh, part of his time that he gives back to the society. So this is why I'm here and this is why I'm being part of this campaign. We started off by learning American Sign Language last year. This year the campaign is all about learning Emirati Sign Language. So that is what I'm starting to learn and what I'm also trying to spread to the people who are joining us during the campaign. The truck attracted residents and tourists who received an impromptu lesson on the local sign language. The Lava Minutes built-in photo booth documented them signing the word they learned and collected the photos which were presented at the conference as a strong show of support from the community. I have two nieces that are deaf and they motivated me to learn sign, more about sign language. Last year I went to America with one of my nieces for a, an, to a deaf school and there we were taught how to sign we were for a whole month and uh, after that I felt more closer to my nieces. I think it's very important to participate in such uh, projects uh, and I'm very active and I want to help people and that's it. And I, I love people, that's my sign it was. We want to help the deaf people and bring some attention and also participate. Learning the basics of a sign language is a good place to start. Simple and common words like hello, thank you, welcome all encourage inclusion for deaf people. It may open up a conversation, lead to friendships and even opportunities when we hear them sign.